Okay, so if everybody could gather around in a semicircle around the altar here, we're going to get started. And is everybody ready? <laughs> Kelly here is going to explain, or going to start our ritual tonight, and just uh, kind of follow along. <laughs> So, all of you have already danced the Maypole and had a feast, so you already know this is all about the celebration. It's the celebration of the dance of life. Beltane is our great spring holiday of the goddess, and it's halfway to Samhain. And Samhain is the time where we honor the dead. So, as you may know, tonight is the night we honor the living, honor the full life, the rebirth of the earth, of ourselves and of our continuation of the cycle of the earth. This festival celebrates all of the living things on this planet, the trees, the plants, the earth itself, all of us being on it. So there's this just vibrating energy that I feel at this time of, of uh, life, this fertility of creativity, of new beginnings, and all those things that continue to unfold in our own lives. We are thankful then and have this heart full of gratitude at this time for all the bounty of this earth. You know, most of the time in other parts of the um, world, it would not be, or let's say in this hemisphere, it would not be as green and lush and all of these new things coming out. You just see little sprigs of things coming. Here we're kind of um, spoiled and have had beautiful bounties of flowers everywhere and, and so much rich abundance but you usually don't see that as much in other places. So this was the time where you started to see it. So tonight we are thankful not only for the incredible abundance and of beauty, nourishment, and profound joy of being alive, but of being here together in community. So we celebrate ourselves, we celebrate our connection with one another, and we celebrate all of what we're creating tonight, these intentions of health and love and happiness that not only do we share with one another, but that we send out and share with this entire earth, all those living beings. So I'm going to give you a little rundown of tonight's um, adventures so that everybody has a sense of what's going on. Um, as I said, the intention for tonight, if you can hold, is health, love, and happiness. We are celebrating the dance of life. Um, we are going to have smudging to start so that we can clear away all that is not needed and come truly present in this moment. We're gonna cast a circle and when we do, it's gonna be such a wide circle because again, we're celebrating this earth. And not only are we creating sacred space here, but we're creating sacred space down to the fire pit, beyond our, our walls and our expanses. So one thing, you know, normally when we cast a circle, we'll do something to seal that circle. And tonight to seal the circle after we do, just touch the earth. That'll seal it. Um, Katia is going to Katia is going to teach us the songs that we'll be singing. So I'll, I'm not going to stop at each one, and we'll have you just teach them all at one time. But um, after we create the sacred space, we'll do all our calling in and then chanting, and then we're going to dance. We're so excited to have Lynn and Jim here to teach us Sufi dancing. So thank you so much um, for weaving that into this beautiful tapestry tonight. Um, after we do that, we'll be moving down to the fire pit. We'll see fire dancers. We'll have other ways of creating really strong intentions of manifesting all the abundance and gratitude and love. And uh, then we will be gifted with some goddess bread, and we will then share in that, set our intentions out into the world, and then close our circle. So I invite you, Katya, to teach us our chants now. I'm actually hoping that I don't have to use the microphone to teach the chant. So those of you in the back row, if you can't hear me, let me know. I spend too much time on a microphone. <laughs> 